say that their all-father, Odin, gave his eye in exchange for a drink from Mimir's well, the well of wisdom. In blindness there can be wisdom. Only by giving can you receive in return. For this reason, I give my life and pass on my stories of the Northmen to you, Senua. Can you hear me? I'm right here. Can you see me? No. Help me. Breathe slow. It's the darkness. Stay still. Empty your thoughts. Tell me what you feel. A breeze. Good. Then there is a way out. I can't tell where it comes from. The yes, voices, you can. they've gone. I'm still here. It's so quiet. So dark. It's okay. Listen to your own breath. Feel it rise and fall. Good. Be aware of everything you hear and feel. Let your senses guide you. I think I'm somewhere else now. But the breeze has gone. Use all of your senses. Let the world speak to you. What do you hear? I hear water. Go to it. I've reached the water. Good. That's your way out. Follow it upstream. I'm so sorry. I thought I left this all behind. Don't be sorry. It's not your fault. He was right. It's inside of him. It won't let me go. Senor. My father. He taught me the hardest battles are fought in the mind. Not the sword. Or no coward. Prove that to me in the warrior tribe. This is just another battle. You can beat it. This isn't your battle. You don't have to help me. I want to. Besides, you are going to be a great warrior, okay? We need people like you. Okay. I'll do my best.
quietly move past it, one step at a time. There's more of them. I think they're moving. You're breathing too fast. I'm scared. Listen to the sound of your breath. In and out. In and out. I think I'm in a house. It stinks. Of death. The darkness is testing you. You are in control. As well. Don't turn back. You're getting close. Did you? She could spend hours, days even, trapped within herself, in the dark. You see me? Yes. Your eyes were open, but you were... gone. And when it finally let her go, she could be anywhere, with no memory of how she got there. When it comes for me, I have no power over it. But here, for the first time, Someone was there to help. But I heard your voice. You brought me back. You found your own way back. 
All you needed was a little help. A little hope. tell you a story about a god of the Northmen called Baldur, the second son of Odin. He was beautiful, good and wise. He was fair of feature, he spoke fair words, he gave fair judgments. Light shone from him, only good things were told of him. Yet he was the first of the gods to die. He's waiting for you. He always said he he's close. He cares about you. You can feel he's close. He loves you. I'm calling you. Dillian. Dillian, we're here. Dillian. We're really here. We're coming. through it. It's dangerous. Follow it. What's behind the gate? Where will it take you? It's not safe. Dillian. There he is. There he is. What are you waiting for? Quick, find a way. Find him. Where is he? Where is he gone? Remember, Dillian. We're in the wrong world. He's not here. She's in the wrong world. He's not in this world. He's in the other one. He's in the other one. He's in the dark world. The dark. The world once seemed so simple. Black and white, darkness and light, narrow dividing lines of our own making. Dillian taught her to see further, to peek through the cracks and see the worlds of color stretching away from the glow. Senno explored new paths into the unknown. Without you.
things you love. Years had passed since she left her father. She trained hard alongside her friend, Dillian. She saw things no one else could. Patterns, shapes, movement. An intuition that made her an exceptional warrior. Friendship turned to love. But the shadow of darkness never let her go. And she was caught up in two worlds. That of Zinbel and Dillian. A future. Two realities. Do you remember the way he stroked your hair? Do you remember the way he felt? <laughs> she thought she had light with her. She is pure darkness. is pointless. What are you doing? Why did you think you could make this work? You keep seeing runes. You see runes everywhere. Everywhere? But what if they're not real? What if they don't actually make sense? What if they're a trick? The gods were lying. He was the only one. I think one it makes sense, but really, the gods are playing with you. It makes sense in your mind, but it doesn't make sense. Well, I guess he took after his father, a chieftain who believed nothing he couldn't see, and he happened to be blind. She felt safe in Dillian's arms, and to see the world through his eyes. Slowly, the darkness that had bound her so tightly began to unravel. That's it. Quicker.
watch anyone. Your father cannot understand your darkness. He cannot see through your eyes. No one can. My own father was born blind. Doesn't have the faintest idea of what the night looks like. The word dark to him means as little as the word light. So someone is afraid of the dark. Should we fix them by taking away their sight? Would you give up the beautiful world that you and only you can see just to be rid of your nightmares? Or is this the price you pay for the gift you have? The gift that makes you so special in my eyes. Just another part of the person I know. I left for the wilds to protect you from my darkness. Because I love you. But it made it worse. I'm so sorry. What if this is pointless? What if you're wrong? What if this is not to do with the sword? What if we're wrong? The sword will never be yours. <laughs> what if this is the end? It's just a trick. It's just a pointless test. You've been fooled before. You could be fooled again. You never know which way it's going to go. <laughs> I saw once a plague strike northern lands of ice. It was so terrible that not the oldest man among us could remember the like. Hundreds died. The sickness took nearly every person younger than forty and many older. And where dying mothers gave birth, the marks of the plague were on the babes as they came out of the womb. Where are we? I don't like it. This place feels... What is this place? This place feels... It's... Creepy. Creepy. It feels wrong. It feels strange. Where is it? There he is. There he is. The light. Go towards it. He's in the house. He's going in. He's disappearing. Follow him. Don't let him go. Like the old warrior trials. Dillian will help me. The stench of rot. She can almost taste it. Do you smell it? No. Don't worry. Not everyone can. It was a warm spring day when she went to the river with Dillian and the others. But the water. She could taste the rot. No one else could. She knew something was wrong, something sinister. She begged them to leave, but they just laughed at her. Soon enough, as the bodies piled up, no one was laughing. And they knew that she was not like that.
Genoa! Come to me! Where are you? I'm here! I'm right here! Are you in there? We have to find him. The runes. Come out Focus. Here, on the runes. Focus the runes. Dillian! They're coming for me! It's close, it's close, move right! What shall I do? Where's your sword? To defend yourself. What is that creature? You can't defend yourself. It's Dillian, find the creature. Two more. Two more, two more, two more. Too long. Can you hear him? You're Two lost. Rooms. You have to find them. Where are you? The light. Go towards it. Focus. 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 Look. I have to find one more. One more. Uh, find the Shano! What happened? They're blaming me for the plague. They say that I'm cursed. What if they're right? How would they know such a thing? Are they gods? None of us are. They're just... people. Good people, but they're scared. They're afraid of what they can't see. Like children scared of the dark. They make up stories to fill the void. That doesn't make no trouble. What if my father was right? You have to step out of this darkness. Let them see who you really are like I am. You're not a monster. Without you, the darkness has made me a monster. Killing you would be too easy. They're taking your memories to torture you. They're taking you from the inside. You're disappearing one memory at a time. Every time you remember, it disappears. They're going to take everything. They're not yours anymore. They're going to take everything you have. The memories of ghosts. They belong to the gods, not to you. They're eating you from the inside. They want to kill your soul. They want to crush it. They think they want your body. They want your soul. They want your mind. And they're going to take it. The memories were yours, but they're the gods now. Nothing is yours. A king in the north forced the dwarves to make a sword that would never fail and never rust, and that would slice through iron and stone and bring victory to its bearer. But the angry dwarves cursed it 
It would be the death of a man every time it was drawn. And it would be the death of the king. Let me tell you about the sword Tyrving. I don't recognize this place. Where are we? Where is she? It feels wrong. Where are we now? Burial mound. It's so strange that we go to such lengths to bury death. Something so very ordinary. Inevitable. It's as if we conspire to hide death because we have no answer for it. But when it comes and forces itself onto our friends or loved ones, then comes the reckoning. trials, like when we first met, remember? There he is. There he is. Dilly, there he is. Finally. You found him. What's wrong? What happened? Can you hear me? How did you let him go again? Just wait there. I'll find you. How could you? Find him, get him back. He was just there. How could you lose him? How could she lose How him? How could she find him? I'll find him. The voice is getting louder. Listen, Dillian. <gasps> listen, listen, listen. It's him. Listen. It's getting louder. There he is. You're getting closer. Keep going. Send me follow the voice. You're nearly there.
பார்ப்பாங்க I'm leaving. I've decided. I think it will be good for me. It's the darkness. It's speaking through. No, Dad, it's me. I think I can beat it in my own way. I can see the darkness in your eyes, child. I met a boy. Boy. The chief had some. No. He said he could help me. It's a trick. He said I could be normal. Normal? Yes. No boy is going to save you. No one can. When they see the rot growing no. inside you, no. they will turn their back on you. The gods can only fix you through my hand. You're going nowhere. No. You will not defy the gods. Come, child, take my hand. Come. Send one. No. I am leaving. You cannot escape the darkness. Your curse will make everyone suffer. You will have blood on your hands! You've done it. You did it. The warrior trials. Go get the sword. You did it with the sword. You have to get the sword. With grammar reforged. You will have Odin's blessing to walk, a goddess, into the halls of Helheim and challenge Hela as an equal. So Dillian was helping me. And a sword will lead me to him. And become a warrior. Like when we first met. Come on, come on, come on, come on. The sword is tainted by the gods of darkness. Leave it. No. He left it here. He wants me to take it. You will pay a price for this. But years later, with Zinbel's parting words still haunting her, the darkness came back with a vengeance. A plague. Do you? Everyone suffered. My father was not supposed to die like this. Do you see it clearly now, Senua? The suffering you've caused. This is your fault. You brought this plague to us. You have blood on your eyes.